January 2, 2014, this 50 gram dwarf hamster has a swelling below the right ear. Has been hospitalized for two days with and given medication which includes anti inflammatory antibiotics. As you can see, this swelling is actually part of the lateral ear canal. Just now, when I put the hamster on the table and uh, flip open the canal, the upper part of the canal, pus came out and there was a piece of seed piece of seed coming out too so the diagnosis is pus in the ear canal and that's why the hamster kept scratching the ear and was brought in two days ago Overall, this hamster is easy to handle, and so I will irrigate the ears afterwards and uh, try and get the pass out. As you can see, the site is inflamed, and uh, it will take some time to get the pass out. There might even be some sand, sand or seeds inside the ear canal. Has this hamster is given the sand bath as well, which is quite common in uh, many hamster pet owners. Some of the sand might have dropped in. I mean, just like you're going for swimming in the sea and uh, some sand from the seawater may go into your ears too. Now, the best for a hamster is not to provide the sand bath, but uh, it's very difficult for owners not to do it because it is kind of part of the bathing of the hamster so that's how you get the ears blocked with the sand from the sand bath when the hamster rolls into it but for many hamsters there's no problem of this uh, with this sand bath uh. but I notice uh, the presence of sense bath every day may, uh, may cause the hamster to use it daily and unfortunately sand will drop into the ear canal. There's no way to avoid it. January 1st, 2014, drop by your vets. 9.30 a.m. is a public holiday and uh, there's nobody coming in except for one cat with the fur mites for bedding. So normally I would close in the afternoon. And I still see the hamster still scratching, trying to get rid of the pass inside. In the dock, it should be easy to irrigate the ears because the ear canal is big. But in a dog hamster, it's pretty difficult because the canal is probably uh, about uh, 3 mm or 4mm in diameter. Uh, it will be done in the anesthesia. But, uh, I need the swelling to go down further. Otherwise, you can't irrigate the ears when it is swollen and and closed. Overall, the hamster is eating and uh, it's quite active. So it's the third day of hospitalization.